Shepard. More trouble in the Perseus arm as Reaper forces now control the Hades Nexus and Sentry Omega cluster. For the first time since the Rachni War, the Asari homeworld of Thessia. The clutch is stabilized? Really? That is wonderful news, my sister. You wish to name the first hatch after the one who helped us? I think that's a wonderful idea. is receiving vital and unexpected assistance. Putting aside centuries of hostility, the Geth and Quarians have both agreed to help fight Reaper forces. Damn it, Blasto! I told you to bring in those Forja alive for questioning! This one didn't have anything to ask them. You blew up half a level of Sekiro Ward! It was an aesthetically displeasing habitat anyway. You don't get it, Kaje clan. Ever since they found Izo on the Vorcha homeworld, the council's been trying to make nice. Bottom line, you can't touch the Vorcha. They've got diplomatic immunity. Then this one will not attend to diplomacy. You're also getting a new partner. Are you engaging in reproductive behavior with this one? Unless you want your Spectre status revoked, you're working in a joint operation with Boobin from CSEC. An Elcor? You know this one works alone. Look, I've had to talk them down from suspending you. I've gotten a pulmonary ulcer from dealing with this mess. I can't even eat solid food. You would benefit from shedding excess body mass, Chief. face major setbacks, the Turians and Krogan are still fighting fiercely to keep Paladin. No, the Krogan are the only race that can fight on the toxic world, so they need support. Well, ideally, something like a Cacliosaur. They're good in mountains, immune to toxins, ferociously loyal to their riders. Yes, they'd be ideal. Unfortunately, aside, centuries of hostility, the Geth and So, unless we can engineer something new, Krogan on toxic worlds will have to fight on foot without support. 